Alright, heading over to the south side of the island. We've got to find a beach. Find somewhere to swim and get in this blue water. Yep, definitely decided to take a taxi this go around. Much easier than the bus and all the other things. So I definitely recommend it. back at the apartment uh, we're about to head out again this morning was amazing we spent um, all morning at the, the southern public beach there um, Pichola? Picola Picola um, at the bottom of the island it's the smaller of the the marinas and it's a public beach there so there was a lot of space it I mean it's Saturday but it wasn't crazy busy and it was just an amazing time but we can't get enough of that boat ride so we're gonna go, we're gonna take another boat ride. We're gonna take a sunset boat ride tonight around the island and uh, hopefully get some, concentrate on taking some pictures this time and, and doing some videos. So uh, we're heading out to do that right now. Today has been pretty awesome. Uh, I took another boat ride right at sunset tonight, which was amazing. And uh, t right now we're eating some pizza, Napoli style. <laughs> Not really, it all fell off. Well, yeah, I did carry the pizza boxes a little crooked. So some of the pizza, it was like a half and half. So, but it's still, it's still really good. So we are I'm going to plan a trip to Ana Capri tomorrow, so we'll go to that side of the island and hopefully ride the chairlift and check out everything on that side. We've just been on the, the Capri Town side so far, um, so we will hopefully get to see the other side of the island. But for now, we'll eat some pizza and uh, look at some footage from today, and we'll see you tomorrow. All right, off again, heading to the other side of the island today, Ana Capri. Hopefully... Uh, see some new sites see some historic stuff ma'am you good back there <laughs> okay it's supposed to be a chairlift to the very top of the mountain so hopefully get to check that out one white today that's bold choice 
No? I wear black mostly, but everyone else wears white, so. Well, I'll be representing the dark colors today because this is pretty much what I wear every day. Makes life simple. We just arrived at the top of Anagapri. We're going to do the chairlift up to the top of the mountain. Which is somewhere. Somewhere up there. So put your keys in your wallet and in your pocket. Here we go. All right, on the chairlift, heading to the top of the mountain. It's surprisingly really quiet, and the view is amazing. And Brittany's behind me. I don't know if you can see her. She's back there somewhere. I hope she got on the chair. Because once you go into the platform, I mean, you pretty much just have to fully commit and hop on the chair. Not a whole lot of instructions. So here we are, heading up. on the chairlift and it has stopped oh good we're going again so I'm not stranded a thousand feet in the air that makes it a better Sunday all right then I'll just need to uh, request a wet towel and maybe a new pair of underwear here we go trying to figure out how you would save yourself if you fell? I was not. I was, I was oh. just thinking I'd go head first to make it clean and simple. I was trying to think the worst thing would be. <laughs> you had an incline, so even if you hit, your momentum would flip you backwards yeah, sure. and you would just roll down and down. So I was trying to figure out how I could avoid that. Well. Overall, though, we recommend but now it. We're here. <laughs> uh, back behind me, you see Capri Town, and then you see um, the Italian coast. And Amalfi's on the other side of that. You can see so far from up here. Can you see this right now? This is crazy. Ma'am, please continue your tour um, <laughs> <Damn it. laughs> please don't talk so close to me <laughs> here we go at the entrance of the Blue Grotto down here. 
and it looks pretty choppy so I think they're trying to wait until it calms down a bit and they're going to start bringing people in. waiting in line, about to do the Blue Grotto. Lay down in this little boat right here. So you go underneath the little, little cave. Grotto, and we um, we had talked about doing a boat tour because they have a bunch of them at the marina, and um, we were just up at Ana Capri today, and you're sort of on that side of the island, so we just kind of came down here to see what was going on, and you can walk down the steps right here instead of taking a boat if you want to do the Blue Grotto tour. And it's much faster. The line wasn't long at all. We waited for maybe, I don't know, five minutes for a boat. And then they take you right over to this little ticket boat. And then that's where you pay. And then they take you in through this little tiny hole right here. You go through the person who's like your captain or your boat driver. <laughs> it's captain, right? Yeah, skipper. <laughs> <laughs> they, they have to lay back too so Patrick was here and then I was here and then we go through the line and then he lays on top of me and it's like a big sandwich <laughs> as you all go in all the captains all the people who are working on the little boat they're constantly bickering and fighting with each other over like who should whose turn it is to go in and they just keep using their hands like this <laughs> it's really funny. I'm terrified that I just said a cuss word in Italian. <laughs> but it's from friends. <laughs> I don't know what it really means. <laughs> we'll have to Google it later. <laughs> Alright, we're heading out to the lighthouse. Hopefully catch sunset and some dinner. There's supposed to be a little party out there. A little more dressed up tonight. It's our last night on the island. So we figured we would, uh, I would change my shirt since I've been wearing pretty much the same outfit every day. So I feel good, other than it's gonna be hot. That's good. Yeah, it's not bad. All right, so hopefully we'll see you at the lighthouse. because this guy decided to go all National Geographic on me and I thought he was gonna go into the ocean because he was so close to the rocks trying to get the shot and so I'm up on this like platform like an idiot yelling at you Patrick you gotta get taken by a wave and he's like ah. but the well, shot is pretty good so. that's how you know you're getting a good shot when there's no one else around that's how you know fun tip for you I'm just glad you're dry I am dry. And not in the ocean. Well, I'm not in the ocean, let's just say that. 